campers today I'm going to show you how to make these little cute pansies out of the butterfly punch so let's go ahead and get busy you're gonna start with some napkins I got a bunch of napkins just folded up you're gonna punch out your shimmer white cardstock and you'll want to use the shimmer white because it will hold up for the water so I'm gonna punch out two of those and I'm just going to place them here on the napkin and then I just got some water in a spray bottle and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to spray those butterflies so they get really really wet I don't know if it's going to pick up on the video but they're really really wet and that's going to help the color to spread when I put it on the butterfly and I'm using the more mustard and the elegant eggplant I'm just going to squeeze some reinker out onto the lid And then I'm going to take the aqua painter and inside here is just water and what you do is you unscrew the slid and then you just fill that up with your tap water. Okay. All right. So then I'm just going to squeeze this out to make sure it's clean. Water drips down to the brush. Okay. So then I'm just going to pick up the elegant eggplant with my aqua painter and I'm just going to set this onto the butterfly. And I'm just going to drag it around the edge. And see the water helps spread the reinker. Do both like that, depending on how much color you want to add. Just keep going over that. Okay. I'm just going to clean my brush, and then I'm going to pick up the more mustard, and I'm going to do the same thing. and it should spread. Let me pick up some more elegant eggplant here. And then if it gets too much water, you can just tip it up and let that come off there. Pick up some more mustard. Okay, put that aside to let that dry. And then by the magic of video, I have two already done, so they look like that. And then what you're going to do now is you're going to take your elegant eggplant marker and I'm going to use the fine tip. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put some flower veins in the center of this butterfly. And you want to make them come out pretty far because you're going to layer them on top of each other so they'll show. And then once you get the veins in your flower, they look like that. You're just going to take like a dollar store paintbrush and you're just going to kind of just drag that across that to make those ends curl a little bit. Do them both, same way. You could probably use your bone folder if you wanted to, but I find that the paintbrush works good. Okay, so then after you do that, then you're just going to go ahead and layer them on top of each other. And then take your mat pack and your paper piercing tool. And you're just going to punch a hole right in the center of both butterfly punches here. And then I have the silver brads. I'm going to go ahead and add that right to the center of the flower. like that. Isn't that cute? And then you'll just pop that up on a dimensional and add it to your project. So that's how you do that. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you later. Bye.